So you want to find out more about German kitchen design? Well, what better than to work with a German kitchen designer? Make sure to watch this video and I will share my top seven tips with you on how to design an authentic German kitchen and make sure to stick around to the end and I will share my most favorite German kitchen designs seen on my last Germany trip. And if you haven't done so, make sure to subscribe to my channel. You get to learn everything you need to know about kitchen design and remodeling to work on your own kitchen. Thanks again for tuning in, guys. My name is Kirsten Kopp, specialized kitchen designer with King's Kitchen in Tacoma, Washington. Now let's get started. Here are my top seven must-haves for an authentic kitchen design. Number one a modern kitchen. Germans are super innovative when it comes to technology, design, automotive, uh, construction and building industry, and this definitely reflects in their design choices. So you will be way more likely to find a contemporary design like this one rather than your typical farmhouse design. Number two, frameless cabinets. There are really three ways of making a cabinet. American framed cabinets, you have the inset cabinets, and you also have the European way of cabinet building, which is called Euro cabinet or frameless cabinets, or also Euro box. So when you're working on a German kitchen design, it's an absolute must that you use a frameless cabinet because you will get the most utilization out of your cabinet in space. And we all know that German kitchens are usually a lot smaller than our American kitchens. Number three, a flat panel door style. Now you can absolutely combine this with a small detailed door, like a shaker door style, but you should really think about adding a flat panel door style for an authentic German kitchen design. Wood laminates. If you take a closer look to a lot of German kitchen designs, you will see some sort of a wood laminate incorporated into the design. And the crazy thing is about 75% of today's kitchens in Germany still get laminate countertops, but they're not like the American kind. They're really nicer high-end laminates that are textured, so they're really beautiful, and they hold up extremely well. And Germans like to remodel more often, so they spend usually a little bit less than we do, but they will remodel quite more often. So one way to incorporate wood laminates would be as your really nice countertop, as a, as a textured, nicer form, or secondly, you could think about using a wood laminate and incorporating it into your design as a backsplash or even a second cabinet style. By the way, guys, real quick, make sure to leave me a comment below. I would love to get your feedback on wood laminate countertops. Number five, technology and accessories. Again, guys, Germans are super innovative and German kitchens are rather small, so we have to work really hard to make sure every little bit of space gets used good in a, in a real sufficient way. So you'll find um, lots of technology and accessories in those kitchens. For example, lift up mechanisms, you'll get those a lot from Bloom with um, sometimes even with servo drive, so it's automatic as seen right here. Number six, ergonomic design. Germans are super conscious about their health, so it's very important when you design your kitchen, a space that you're in so much every single day, it's really important that you keep ergonomic movements of your body um, as a feature, you know, you think about that when you design your kitchen. So working in your kitchen can be a breeze and it can it's not so hard on your body. So um, one thing we like in German kitchens are drawers over drawers because drawers are the easiest way to maximize the space used and you can just pull it out in one movement and get everything from within. And then a second feature that I think is really neat and a lot of people love it is an elevated dishwasher. Now this is something you use your dishwasher dishwasher almost every day and you can load your dishwasher without constantly having to bend over. Number seven, symmetry versus asymmetry. 
Most American kitchen designs feel really good when you add a lot of symmetry and balance to the room on all sides, but Germans love to break out of the norm and this, this makes them feel good and it makes them feel comfortable. So using asymmetry in German kitchen design is something you see a lot and this can be done, for example, with breaking up your countertop heights and incorporating different heights. So you can, for example, add a taller section of countertops and use it for a coffee station, or you could have countertop above a double oven and use it as a landing space for your oven or next to a microwave. That is it. I hope these seven tips really inspired you and gave you more inside perspective on how to create your own German kitchen. Now for a lot more real world kitchen design inspiration and remodeling tips, make sure to subscribe to my channel and hit that little bell and you'll get notified whenever we release a new content, which is every single Friday. Now, stay tuned, as promised. Here are some video clips and some pictures of my favorite kitchen designs I've seen on my last Germany trip. Thanks so much for watching. I'll see you guys next time.